You first just want to grab an empty coffee container. So definitely do not throw those babies out. Always keep them. There's always something you could do with them. Then I'm using some Waverly chalk paint in the color plaster. Any white or ivory chalk paint will work for this. I did end up doing two coats. You wanna just dry the first coat before going on to the second coat and then allow everything to completely dry. Definitely don't forget to do that top part of the container as well and let that dry. I then am using this Farm Fresh calendar. These are from Dollar Tree. I'm going to be using the October one, which is the Happy Harvest with the vintage truck on it. And to be able to measure it out, I just placed the calendar page on top of the container and just folded down where I had bent it, where the edges of the container were. Once I had that all measured out, I then just cut down the page to where I folded it down. Now, if you guys don't have this calendar, don't worry. Go on Google and Google image a fall vintage truck and I'm sure you will find something just as close as this. So to be able to adhere it to the canister, I'm just applying some matte finish Mod Podge to the back of the page. You wanna make sure that you have a nice even coat, make sure you get those corners, the edges, everywhere. And then go ahead and place it onto the canister, smooth it down with your fingers to make sure there are no wrinkles or air bubbles. However, if you do end up having a few wrinkles, don't worry, I think it still comes out looking fabulous. Let that dry and then to seal and protect, Go over it again with another layer of Mod Podge and then allow that coat to completely dry as well. When I tell you this was probably the easiest project I have ever created, I'm not lying. So do what you want with this. You could put some utensils inside of it, leave it in your kitchen for that. I think this is really cute. Or you could use this to display some fall floral picks that you picked up from Hobby Lobby, Michaels, Joann's, Dollar Tree. You could even put some foam pumpkins inside of here. Do whatever you want with it. I just thought it was super cute accent piece to have around your house. But I hope this inspires you guys to go out and create your own. Again, definitely save those coffee canisters because you never know what you could do with them. If this inspired you, please be sure to sprinkle the love. Thank you so, so much. And I hope y'all have a good rest of your day. Thanks. Bye.